why is it not always nice and pretty like this picture on the mountain shows? What's happened? Well, that's why we have been. It was late as the time when after seeing this gospel and seeing what God has promised throughout what we used to call the season of epiphany, the manifestations of the power of Christ, now we sit down and say, why not us? Why not today? Why not now? And if we take that seriously, God will answer. If we seriously make an effort to, God, we want that kingdom here today. We want to be able to walk in the first fruits of that kingdom. We don't have to wait until we die and then are resurrected again when Christ returns. Can we experience your power now? And I believe the testimony of Scripture is yes. If we seriously have that burden in our hearts, that desire in our hearts, and we pay attention and live, the Lord will show us why. And the Lord will show us how we can walk in these things again. I firmly believe that. But we have to be the ones. Now this coming Wednesday, Bishop Ariel is going to share during the Ash Wednesday services in the morning and probably in the evening too about listening. And it's just taking up from where this is. I'm kind of laying the foundation. He doesn't know it, but I am. Laying the foundation for him. He's going to share about listening. This very topic. And then in the next Wednesdays of Lent, we priests are going to be sharing about love. Because the theme of the year is the body building up itself in love. Built up into being a kingdom of priests. Like, you know, we're supposed to be from way back in Moses' day. But it only happens through love. And I would challenge us as a Lenten discipline, make an effort to be here on these Wednesdays. Make an effort to certainly be here on Ash Wednesday and receive what Bishop Ariel would share about listening to God. And on the following Wednesdays, when the, the rest of the priests will share about the different aspects of love and how love empowers us to be strengthened in the body and enables us to walk in God's kingdom. So that's what, that's where we are. At the end of this season, formerly known as Epiphany, this is the picture of the kingdom of God on earth. Now if we're ready to take that seriously, ready to make that happen, welcome to land. Please stand.